Come along with me for a day in the life of a Rucker softball player on a game day. This is our trainer, Zach. Good morning, Zach. Good morning. I'm just grabbing a hot pack to warm up my leg. Just come over here and grab this. Our trainer, Zach, helps us with any injuries we may have during season. And this is what our lockers look like right when we get to the field. So we start getting ready for the game and I put on two unders because it's around 35 degrees. So I have lost my BP top. So we're off to find our equipment manager so I can get a new BP top because I can't find mine. Hey, I need a BP top. Thank you so much. After we're all dressed for the game, we have a quick film session. She just hit Katie. She walked Peyton on inside pitches that were too far in. She just hit Katie. Okay. But again, Fox beat them already earlier today on outside. Holy snikes. That should have been the ball game right there. Everybody see that? She just hit somebody. She just walked somebody. Right Again, she's trying to go inside. She can't do it. She can't do it consistently. Right? After film, we have breakfast. We usually have meat, eggs, and a fresh fruit. I got one on at the end of the game, which means it's fine. How excited are you guys for the game today? I'm so excited. Woo! Yay! Hey, hey, hey. Morgan. After we're done with the breakfast and we finish our film, we go down to start warming up for the game. We jog, stretch, and throw, and then we take a few rounds of BP. Hey, Okay, we just finished hitting for pregame. Now we're on our walk down to the field. Woo! Woo! Okay, so here's the situation. We are in the top of the 10th inning with Ohio State. The score is eight to eight. Our goal is to get three up, three down, and then somebody, either Morgan, Peyton, or Katie, will hopefully hit a home run. But I shouldn't say that too loud, you know? <laughs> We can't be swinging for the fence, but we should totally be swinging for the fence here. So, anyways, that's the situation. Here we are. We are approaching the field. Go! Scarlet Knights are going to have a day. If we win a game today, we get two days off. We get Monday and Tuesday off, so that's going to be absolutely iconic for us. Our bodies are shot. We had like a 10-day trip the 9th through the 19th of March, and then we traveled after that to Virginia, so we've been absolutely just so busy. Our bodies need a break. It rained a lot yesterday, obviously, as you can see. We are in the mud. All right, here we are at Rutgers Field. <laughs> to her, now also college coaches. L.A. Matthews drives this to center. Epley is at the fence, it's off the middle of the wall. Kylie Sand has all the speed in the world, so she's gonna score. And L.A. Matthews slides into third with a go-ahead triple. So I'm now in my car. Rutgers was able to get the win. This is our first time winning the series over Ohio State in Rutgers history. So we were really excited. There was a lot of stuff going on after the game. But thanks for coming along with me today in a day in the life of a softball player on game day.